The earthquake storm, which started early in the morning, created a fascinating eruption in the Reykjanes Peninsula of Iceland. It just spread from nothing to two distinct clusters of earthquake swarms. Definitely earthquake storm. It was more than 100, probably hundreds of it, and the eruption was imminent. And that was the moment of the eruption. We had this just to the north of the uh, defensive wall that is built around the town of the Grindavik in Iceland. It cut through it and appeared on the other side of this massive structure. And as you can see here, it was almost in line with the previous eruption from 2024, January of that year. At the moment, it looks subsided, but we see some movement there. These are all the tiny lights you see there in the dark. These are the glowing lava. And even we have some tiny eruptions. I will show you that. There are some vents inside that uh, fissure, which are still erupting. And I will show you in a, in a second. That's here. This is activity in that area. You can see that. They are erupting. The two clusters that I mentioned, one of them is actually subsided. This is the Green Dubic one, which I showed you. And uh, another one we have to the north, and North Swarmer called it. It may erupt later. Of course, this is one uh, interpretation of this data. As it happened in the past, we had the eruption in the south, then it is uh, extended to the north. And uh, it... It is quite possible that such a thing happens, and it was according to what I predicted in the one of the previous videos. Um, the first eruption near the Grindavik, near just behind the, the defensive wall, and then another one to the north. Of course, not everybody is convinced by that, and uh, we have also the possibility that just this uh, earthquake storm opened the fissure, opened the a pathway for the magma to rise erupt at one end near the Grindavik, but not enough to erupt at the other side, which is into the north. It just fills up the gap that is created by the extension of the uh, plate boundary. We have to wait and see, but lava is still is flowing in that south 